we've got we've got a super exciting day today. We are helping our friends pick out their Christmas tree, like a proper Griswold family Christmas tree, a James family Christmas tree. We're going to go off um, into a field or somewhere and pick out a tree and they cut it down, which is super exciting. Never done it before, so that's that's cool. And then we are spending the day with our friends and our friend Trish. She doesn't like to be on camera, so you probably will never see her. Um, with uh, we're spending the day with Trish and Stuart, and Trish is doing a trial run of Christmas Day. Um, so today is going to be like a fake Christmas for us. So we're putting up the tree, we're going to basically do some Christmas decorating and I'm literally, I'm so excited, my hair with my hair extension and I've done like Christmassy makeup. Whenever I wear this eyeliner, everybody always says to me, what is it? And it is a Sephora, obviously you can't get it in this country, so we used to go to Paris a lot. Whenever we used to go to Sephora or Paris or New York, I always used to go top up on these and it is their own brand, Electric Blue Eyeliner, and it, it is lovely. It goes on and it stays on all day. And every single time I wear it, people say to me, my God, your eyeliner is so lovely. Um, but L'Oreal have just started to do one, and if you go into Boots, you will find a version of this. I don't think it's quite as bright, but if you are traveling and you want some of this eyeliner, but yeah, it's Sephora. We also wanted to say a huge thank you for everybody who's leaving the most wonderful comments. It's so, so sweet. It's so lovely to connect with you guys and have a chat. And it's so nice that I've like reconnected with a few people, like my cousin Abigail, hello. And she comments on nearly every single um, video. And it's like, oh, it's so lovely. It really is lovely to have you guys as friends. Truly amazing. I'm loving, loving the um the youtube community i think it's just wonderful so thank you very very much my tree shopping outfit basically consisted of some holland cooper legging jobper things i love to wear because they're super comfortable a pair of hunter wellington boots and my holland cooper jacket with an h&m jumper nice and cozy for a very chilly day picking out a christmas tree Grange Farm that sells the Christmas trees was absolutely incredible. It had everything. It had a shop. You could even pet a donkey. You'll see later. There were some donkeys there. They sold everything from kindling to wood to Christmas trees. There was wreaths there. The huge, huge shop. On a moose. Christmas moose. It's a deer, it's Christmas. Tough audience. Anyone who recognises that clip, leave a comment. They are cool. Salt and pepper shakers. Are they good? Are they? found the James family Christmas tree? That one? Um, I think this is the perfect one for the back of the boat. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Well, we can you've, got, you've got the height. Yeah. We've, we've got the height. We're on the back of the boat. This is perfect. And yeah. obviously we can put some kind of hinge on it if we ever go out. We can just fold yeah. it down yeah. through the bridge back up again. <laughs> is that the Bacchus family Christmas tree? Bacchus family Christmas tree. One of those. Or one at each end. Stu sure getting all sentimental about trees. He's like, Just today, next look Saturday. at that one. How sad is that one? Say that again. Oh, well, that poor tree. That poor tree. It's, it's so a, sentimental. It's got a wiggly bit.
way. I found your you tree. Found me a tree. I found you a tree. I found you the tree that I think you should get. Are you sure? That one. <laughs> or this little one. That little one. Oh. Get it and get it and put it in the snug as well. Look how cute that is. Well, I've been told I can only get one. You can only buy one? Yeah, but... Who are you shopping with? But... Who are you shopping with? There's literally hundreds and hundreds of trees. It's absolutely insane. Stuart can't find his tree. He literally, he can't decide. It's hilarious. This is it. The James family the James tree. James family Christmas tree. It's going in the house. never fit in the yard. Oh it's yeah, it's, going going, in it's not going in the yard. It's going on top of your boat. I'm just waiting for the post-production sort of um, angel lights to come on it. Oh. <laughs> you know, I've just brought you here so I'm going to eat it. I love these so much. Does our one need a friend? Uh, I like the bottles. Sort of, but don't like Prosecco. Even if I don't drink Prosecco. <laughs> matches your colour scheme um, and if it matches your colour scheme you can then go and buy the whole tree and they, they send it in pieces so you just connect them all together and that's took us a you while. know you're mad didn't you and this is completely alcohol free no yeah. alcohol yeah. So my outfit for this evening, I decided to wear a pair of Zara split hem trousers and a shirt. I've got these trousers in a few different colours and they are super, super comfortable. But I decided to go for a green with a black satin shirt and with my Manolo shoes that I actually found off of eBay a few years ago. And Trisha Stewart's house is like our second home. It's so lovely. as well right we're gonna enjoy our Christmas I don't think I'm gonna be filming that much because Trish doesn't she doesn't mind me filming but she's like don't film me there's toilet they have a Beano collection so you can see that in the background this is what this is hope you've enjoyed today's video guys and we'll see you again in the next narrowboat mess <laughs>